Hello everyone, welcome back to our Facebook page. We have to take the jeans, fold it like this to make the frills on it. So you can see, now take a needle and the thread. You have to put it like this and fold the needle and the thread like this. So you can see how we are doing it. Put it one by one. Now you have to put the threads over the needle by rolling it like this. Perform this step very carefully, do not hurt yourself. Now we have to put the needles like this and the threads over it to each other. So you can see how we are folding it. Now after that you can put a stone or a beautiful pearl in the between. Now repeat the process again and fold the threads and put it like this. Now pull out the needle like this and you will get a beautiful pattern like this. And you can put it on the collars of your t-shirts and it will look very beautiful. Next you can take this rubber strip like this. Tie it with the help of the green thread as shown in the video. Put the threads in the between and then stretch it and make a V-like shape. So you can see now take a red color thread and then we'll be making the cherries using it. So tie the threads over the needle and roll it and pull the needle like this. Fix it and look it's done. Next we have to take a t-shirt and then take a red color thread. Now you have to put it like this. So stitch two collars together. So you can see we have done it. Now mark the lines over it and then you have to put the pearls like this. You can see we are putting the thread and the pearls one by one. Now stitch it like this. So you can see we'll be putting the pearls in the equal distance as shown in the video. So you can see, so it's that we have to mark the lines. So you can also mark the dots on the equal distance if you are not so good at the measurements. So keep it like this and then put the dots and then repeat the process. You have to put the pearls over the t-shirt like this one by one and repeat the process like this and then stretch the thread together and it will get a beautiful frilled look in the between like this. Now at the end, tie the thread and make the knots and look it's done, how beautiful it's looking. Next you can make these patterns, so take a thread and the needle, now mark the dots over the t-shirt and on the dots we have to put the red color threads like this, put the stone in the between and again repeat the process like this. So now keep repeating the process, you have to put the stones or the pearls in the between and then put the needle on the other side, pull out the stretch threads like this and then again put the pearls one by one. So you can see we are repeating the process. Put the pearls in a single line like this. You can see we are arranging it and then at the end we have to pull the threads tightly and the threads will go inside and just the pearls will be looking on the top of the t-shirt and it will look very beautiful. So take a V letter and then take the threads like this. You can see. Now pull the threads tightly and look it's done i hope you liked it next you have to take a round shape object and mark the dots over the socks like this or you can use it on the torn clothes so now put the threads to make the star like shape so you can see it's going to cover the torn part now keep repeating the process and at the end it will turn out to be a snowflake so keep watching the video and follow these steps along and look, we are turning it into a snowflakes and how beautifully it's contoured. And your beautiful torn socks is turned so beautifully with the help of these threads. And look, it's done. I hope you liked it. Thanks for watching our video.